Hey guys, it's Lori. Today's Costco day. I gotta go do a job real quick and then I'm gonna be back. I'm gonna take you with me to Costco. I don't know how much I'm gonna take you with me inside the store, but I'm gonna take you with me anyway. And I'm gonna take you home with me and show you what I got too. So, just like magic, I will be right back. Boom, just like magic. I'm here. I'm here at Costco by myself, filming myself. It's so nice outside. Here we go. Okay, I'm done at Costco. I've been there for like in there for like three and a half hours. And I think I walked the entire store. There's a little sneak preview of my cart. It was so busy today. It was crazy busy in there today for a Monday. I really didn't think it would be busy, but it was. So I did not get my camera out in there at all because I didn't want to film in front of everybody. <laughs> Usually doesn't bother me, but now when I'm by myself, you know? I am home and everything is brought in. John got his workout in, bringing everything in for me. Anyways, here we go. Let's do the refrigerator stuff first so I can get it put away. First thing I got was the giant bag of carrots, the baby carrots. This is a five pound bag for $5.79. I also picked up one of these great big packages of ground beef. I wrote it down over here, 6.59 pounds, $21.68 or $3.29 a pound. The six pack of romaine hearts for $3.99. This time I got a smaller spinach. Last time I got the giant bag, but this time I just got the one pound container of the organic baby spinach because last time it was too much and some of it went to waste and I don't like to do that so it was $4.99 for this. I got something that's not keto, not low carb. Um, this will be for a weekend meal. Maybe we won't eat, maybe John and I won't even eat it. I don't know but I've heard that this is really really good so I decided to try the orange chicken. This is actually four pounds and two ounces so it was it's regular price $13.98, but I wrote it here on the back. It was on coupon for $4.50 off, $9.39 for this. So that's pretty good for a whole family meal. These I got for the boys for after school snacks or Hayden when he's here. Anna will probably love these too. $6.59. And as you can see, there's 72 bagel bites in here. I got two of these, two pounds each. The Colby Jack cheese and the mild cheddar, $4.99 a piece. That's actually a better price than Aldi. This is five pounds of shredded cheese and it was $11.99. There's two bags, which is really nice. <laughs> There's two bags here, which is really nice because I have a container that I can put it in, but it never all fits when I get the big five pound bag at Walmart. So, and this I believe is cheaper than the one at Walmart. This I know is cheaper, but I don't remember how much cheaper. This big three pound tub of Faye, $6.49. I got the spinach and artichoke dip. It's almost two pounds. It's 31 ounces, $7.99 for this. I picked up another 24 ounce container of the feta cheese. We really, really like this. $6.99 for this container, which isn't too bad. Um, John loves it too. I got the Kerrygold butter again. I got three of them, $7.99 for these. I think I got three last time and we almost ran out. So yeah, we have a little bit left. Okay, for some reason my camera shut off. I don't know why, it's done that before though. So anyways, I'm not sure how much you heard about the coffee, but it's a three pound can. I've heard it's good. I'm gonna try it in the percolator. If we don't like it in the percolator, it'll be fine for iced coffee. So not a big deal. Okay, this is definitely not a keto choice whatsoever, but this, the kids will definitely eat this. I'm going to give a couple boxes of this to my oldest. Um, yeah. $12.89 for 18 boxes. Or, to break it down, it's 71 cents a box. Good deal. Okay. Jeez. You want me to show that next? Here. All right. I guess he wants me to show this next. These are two big old whopping bottles of the Lee and Perrin's Brad Worcestershire sauce. $6.89 for the two-pack. This was an impulse buy, and this is something that I got because I wanted it, and I believe it was 
for this 32 ounce jar of pickled beets. I am the only one that will eat these unless Hayden likes them. So, there you go. You like pickled beets? Really? I didn't know you liked pickled beets. Oh. Well, okay. There you go. Six ninety nine for these two bottles of Olive Garden dressing, and they are twenty four ounces each. I got an eighteen ounce container of granulated garlic for five dollars and forty nine cents, and it is granulated California garlic. That's right. Brendan loves his chocolate milk. You guys know that if you follow me. I got a two pack of the Simply Five Hershey's chocolate. I usually just get the regular, whatever the regular is. But I thought I'd try this one this time. At least I know I'm not gonna call this healthy by any means, but I think it might be a little bit better than the other. Probably not, but whatever. Eight dollars and sixty nine cents for this, and these are two. 48 ounce bottles. I got a three pack of Captain Crunch. There is the peanut butter crunch, crunch berries, and regular Captain Crunch. So three boxes, $5.99. That's a really good price. This is a total of 55.8 ounces of cereal. So $5.99 is a really good price for that. And my kids are going to love this. These Ziploc bags. I am almost completely out of Ziploc bags. I was almost out of, completely out of so many things, it's crazy. So, $13.59 regular price for these. It was $2.75 coupon. So, $10.84, I think is what I wrote. Yeah. So, that's a pretty good price for all these bags. That's a lot of bags. 347 bags. Yeah. So, there you go. I got this big 200 pack of the 13 gallon trash bags. That's what we use in the kitchen. $13.99 for this. I accidentally got the flex kind. I didn't mean to. I usually don't get that kind, but whatever. 12 cans of organic tomato sauce for $7.99. And these are all 15 ounce cans. So that's good. I did go ahead and pick up the 100 count K cups the caribou again because John really enjoyed that $46.99 so it's kind of pricey but it's actually a pretty good deal considering how many you get so it is a little bit more than the Aldi's but he prefers that kind so yeah. I actually got two of these <laughs> four packs of Lysol toilet bowl cleaner okay $7.79 regular price but they were on coupon $2.50 off $5.29 or $1.32 a bottle that is a really good price for this, and I will use these for work. So, good price. They also have 10 box tops on top if your kids save those. So each one of those has that. If your kids don't save them, then you should save them and sell them on eBay. Because people do buy those on eBay. <laughs> In case you wanted to know. <laughs> I got this great big 250 ounce, 160 loads, Arm & Hammer with the OxyClean laundry soap, $10.99. Normally I make my own. I am on my last jug right now and I'm not sure when I'm going to have time to make my own. So, there you go. 40 pound bag of fresh stuff cat litter. <laughs> $10.49. Really good deal because that's only like $3 more than I pay for the 20 pound container at Walmart. Yeah, good deal. Good nabby. Where I'm going to store that cat litter, I haven't figured that part out yet, but I'll find a bucket or something to put it in. I was really surprised to see this. I really, really thought they would be gone because they had them last time we were there and I almost picked them up, but I thought, no, I'll get them next time. Thought for sure they'd be gone. 80 count package of Play-Doh. Little tiny containers that you can pass out for trick or treat. I think that's awesome. Sometimes it's nice to get something other than candy, right? So $13.99 for this. I think it's well worth it. If I don't use them all, I know the little kids here will play with them for sure, so I'm really happy to get a hold of those. This is a giant 5.6 ounce bag, no, 5.6 ounce, 5 pounds, what does it say, 5 pounds and 6 ounce? Something like that, I don't know, but this is a big old whopping bag of candy. <laughs> and it's the good stuff, like Kit Kat, Snickers, Milky Way, Twix, no they're not for you, are these for you? I didn't say you, they for me, I asked if you were two of those. 
Do these fit your macros? <laughs> That's not even what he said. I'm giving him crap now. That's what we can. York peppermint patties. We've got M&M's in there. Yeah. So, huh? Peanut M&M's too. And Kit Kats. Did you hear me say that? Huh? Did I say this was $15.99? It was $15.99. My camera's driving me nuts. It keeps shutting off and cutting things out. I don't know what's going on with it, but anyways, didn't get a chance to show you this bag. It, I showed you, but it shut off on me. So anyway, Funhouse Treats. This was $13.99 and it is a 92 ounce bag. So it has Skittles, it's got Starburst, um, Gummy Lifesavers, Twizzlers, Sour Patch Kids, Gummy Bears, Nerds, Swedish Fish, and Sweet Tarts. This should be enough candy for my trick or treat. Okay, it also cut out this four pound, two and a half ounce can of tuna. And I'm gonna do my tuna cakes with these. And if it turns out really good, I'm gonna try, I'm gonna put them in the freezer and see how it turns out. And if it turns out really good, I'm gonna get a couple more big cans of this and make up a whole bunch for the freezer. And this was $9.99 for this giant can. You did not see this great big 13 and a half pound bag of baking soda. And it was $5.99, I believe. And it was it is a much better deal than the big box that I buy at Walmart. And you also didn't see my gigantic jar of pickles. This is a half gallon of pickles and Hayden loved these so much. They are all gone from last time. Last time we went was like five weeks ago, I think. Something like that. I don't know. It was August 28th and today is October 2nd. So over here I have the waters and this is the 40 bottles of 16.9 ounce bottles. $2.99. Can't beat it. These are the eight ounce bottles. 80 of those for $6.99. Over here I have two rotisserie chickens. Brendan came home from football practice and he was starving. So, here we go. Look at this. I just want to show you guys. I don't even know if you can see how juicy this is. Not really focusing, but it's a three pound rotisserie chicken for $4.99. I haven't tried it yet, but I hear that they're really, really good. So, I got two of those. What we don't eat, I'll take off the bone and put it in the freezer for a casserole. You guys, my camera's driving me batty. No sound here. I'm trying to tell you this is crumbled bacon or bacon bits for $11.79 for a 20 ounce bag. Which that actually sounds like a lot of money for this little package because it's actually a huge package for bacon bits, but it doesn't feel like it's very heavy at all. It's only 20 ounces, $11.79. If you add up how many little packages that you buy at the grocery store for what, two bucks or whatever, would fit into this bag, it's a good deal. And I picked up a bag of these wisps that are just like the little Parmesan crisp things that I buy at Walmart for like two sixty something a piece, I think, or something. Maybe I don't remember. This is a better deal anyway. So nine dollars and seventy nine cents, and it is a nine point five ounce package. They are kind of pricey, but it doesn't take much really. You throw these on a salad. This will go. This will last a long time. I picked up an 80 count refill of these um, dry Swiffer pads and it was regular price $14.99. It was on coupon for $3 off so it was $11.99 for this which is actually a pretty decent price and uh, it's the time of year, it's fall. My animals are shedding so bad. I need something quick and simple, clean it up and go. I can't, I can't keep, you know, having cat hair flying all over the place all the time. Anyway. Okay, one last thing that you did not see was these travel mugs. I got these for John for his birthday because he keeps complaining about the ones that he has. These were $18.99 with a $4 off coupon. So they were $14.99 and they're supposed to be good. Six hours hot, 16 hours for cold. So we'll see how those work. I never told you my total. $450. Five dollars and forty-four cents. Holy crap! Don't tell John. Ha. Huh. Yeah, I didn't tell him because he didn't ask. If he asks, I'll tell him. There you go. Okay, so that's everything. I had a good time making this video. I hope you enjoyed watching. Thank you very much. See ya.